new beginning. Don't slow down, Pan Am. Not yet. Great, Pan Am. We're going home. Don't look back. The 
weight it takes off your shoulders. I, I can't even describe it. All right, enough lecturing. Take it easy, then. Hey, V, listen, I don't think I'll make it back to camp tonight. Sandstorm's coming our way. No choice but to sit tight and hold it out. Just wanted to say, uh, I know this isn't the first time. You know, that we had plans. Never realized how hard being a chief would be. Always looked so easy from the outside. I'm just... I'm so lucky to have you, V. You can't even begin to imagine how much it means to me. Storm's how... closing in! 30 seconds to blackout! Guess it's time to go. I'll make it up to you. I promise. V. Hey. Christ. That run we did. My heart's still pounding. The pack of nomads versus Arasaka. Oh, oh, oh. I mean, the odds were totally stacked against us. I didn't know if we'd get out alive. But hey, we made it. And you know why? Because you were the one leading the charge, V. The craziest, baddest merc from Pacifica to the Appalachians. I don't know what you're up to right now, what your plans are. But just remember, we've walked through hell and back with you, brother, anytime. Until next time, eh? Take care. Hey, Rogue here. I wanted to... Oh, voicemail. <laughs> Why not? V? I was wondering if you could pass the message along to Johnny. Two messages, actually. One, that he's an arrogant, egotistical son of a bitch. And second, that it was nice to talk to him again. Both of you, take care of yourselves, okay? Hey, B, so funny thing just said- Oh, fuck, fuck's sake, voicemail again. Do you ever answer the phone? Like, ever? Seriously. I can get through to data term customer service faster than you. Uh, what did I even want? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know that us cracks agent called me and asked if I would go on tour with them? At first, I was like, over my dead fucking body. But then I thought, hey, wait. I could actually be fun. So, uh, well, there's the latest gossip for you, if you can care. Call me back when you can, okay? Peace out! B, hey. So, here's the thing. A couple fellas from the 5th Precinct busted a shop selling illegal iron. Sawed-offs, stun guns, mustard gas canisters. Orders from on up were to blow it all to the ground. But then I thought... There's a better way to use all this stuff for a good cause. I still remember what you did for us, for me and Randy. This city needs more people like you. I'm gonna make sure they're equipped. This one's on me, V. See you around. Before samurai committed to seppuku, they wrote to say. A death poem. It contained their final thoughts about life, about death. I have read many of them of late. Some are truly works of beauty. Yet, I am not a samurai, so I bid you farewell with simple words. Rot in hell, Xero. Hey, V. Listen, I was just thinking about you, so I laid out a quick tarot. I know, I know the reading's not as strong without you here, but we haven't seen each other for so long, and I... Well, one thing led to another. You know what I drew? The chariot, the lovers, and the sun. <laughs> Looks like you've got a good life ahead of you, out in the Badlands. Good luck, V. Be free.